So my name is Strella Service. I'm based in Los Angeles. I am Filipina and uh, born and raised and still live in uh, the greater LA area. Um, I'm a mother, I'm a partner, I'm a caretaker to uh, my elderly mother and my mother-in-law. And um, currently I am a coach and a consultant for social justice and environmental justice organizations and leaders. Um, I spent over 20 years in the social justice movement. And what brought me to this work was um, I actually first went back to the Philippines after graduating from college and spent time with some of the most impoverished communities there, the workers, the farm workers, um, and they were being exploited by large multinational corporations. So I developed uh, this really deep analysis of how imperialism and capitalism is at the root of why people become poor um, and why their rights are stripped away and how it informs policies and things like immigration. And so I decided to dedicate my life to social justice. Um, so then I became an organizer for a small grassroots organization called the Filipino Worker Center that organizes low wage Filipino uh, and Latinx caregivers and household workers. And so we were, we helped spearhead the first household worker bill of rights and set the stage for the national domestic worker movement. And then we also helped uh, lead uh, the first immigrant rights movement in LA um, that then became the part of the bigger national movement for immigrant rights. And then from there, I then shifted over to environmental justice. So I became the co-director of the California Environmental Justice Alliance and I was there for 10 years. And then I helped lead some of the nation's cutting edge, equitable energy, climate justice and EJ policies. So I helped to grow the EJ movement in California. Um, and we were always rooted in grassroots power building and working to ensure that state policy making is done from the ground up. Um, and then after I transitioned away from Seha, I decided to put all my skills towards supporting and developing leaders, particularly uh, Black, Indigenous, people of color, women, and LGBTQ identified organizers and movement leaders. And so that's you know how I became a coach and a consultant um, now. And then I'm also a certified forest therapy guide, which means basically means I get to connect, reconnect people to um, nature. Yeah, so that's 